Yo, what's up, guys? It's me again, and we're back with um, more of this Edinburgh Escape Edinburgh, I think it is. So, um, last time we went into a cave over there up those steps and crap, and we had to get this big green one, but it kicked me out of the game up after it uploaded the last one. So, I'm just gonna have to do all these separately and then make a cut where I can just do all of them again and then we can see the ending. So, yep, this just says all the stuff, bloody long ago Asian simulations. I'm not going to do it again because it's like 10 at night and I don't want to read it again. Um, so, yeah. This will be episode 2 and we have to look for the second or th just another one of those secret entrances with the bloody words and stuff because that means we can go in there and then do our challenge. So. Normally, whenever there's steps, there's one of those things. So, I've got these steps. Oh god, no, not the dead chicken. What's that? I hear something. It's like. Whoosh, whoosh. I hear something, I don't see something. Maybe I'm going insane. I'm bloody crazy. I don't know what I'm looking for. No basement doors or anything. Is there any more stairs? Oh, yep, there we go. Anything hidden down in this corner down here? Jump. There's another house to be out of I think I just gotta keep going up maybe. Is this leading to me like a volcano or something? That'd be sick. I know we already had a volcano in the game, but like a one made by people. I wanna check behind the waterfall too. Always check behind the waterfall, kids. Life lesson. Lesson learned, my kids. I mean my children. Kids. <laughs> You are my kids now. I adopted you. Um, I don't see nothing back there. I have to check behind the waterfall because it's just me. Nope, nothing there. I don't know where this thing is. <laughs> What's that? I see light. Run towards the light. Run towards the light. Oh, words. All right, that makes a lot more sense. All right, that means that's where one of those things that we have to go to. Uh, you come across a break in the rocks, and without thinking, you take a leap of faith into the ravine. Whee! Oh, how did I live through that? I think I'm Superman. Oh. That's not bloody helpful, is it? Didn't do anything. Don't tell me I have to go all the way. No! <laughs> I have to run all the way back up there? Are you kidding me? Yo, what's up, guys? It's me. I'm back with Escape from Edinburgh. So, last time we went to like this real big ravine. And um, we got it out through this little area, but it kicked me out of the game when I uploaded that one. So um, I'm just going to like, whenever I finish this one and then the next one and that one, I'm just going to do the entire game again and then see the, um, see the ending. So I did actually do one of these before, but I didn't get into the um, place I had to go to because I died. And it took me like an hour to find the thing. So I'm just going to start off fresh. Fresh and easy. This is what took me so long climbing these stairs because I had to climb the stairs and then check every individual house, as you can see. All doors, open, most doors open. I closed some of the doors whatever reason
god, I really like one of those lingo boingo things right now. Boing, boing, boing. I'm just gonna put it on auto run and have a little snooze here. <laughs> I thought it was a shack before, that rock. Looks like one. <sighs> Alright, so we gotta jump down this little tiny hole. So you come across and then and then and then and then the take a leaf for fate. It's what I did before, but I missed the bloody Boing Boing Checkpoint Alright, so we gotta jump over here. What's this? Oh that's what that is. Oh boing. Oh Where do I gotta go now? Up there? I'd say it's grabbed to go. Whoop. Oh no. Oh no, I'm good. No! Oh, far out, that was so close. No! No! Why? I hate life. Well, I gotta do all that again because I'm a failure. What? No, I clearly got that checkpoint. You boys, you saw that. That's stupid. 